Today is Good Friday. Today we remember all that Jesus did for us. We remember how Jesus died on the cross to save us all. So today we're going to spend some time journeying through the stations of the cross together. Let's begin in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. How often do I ignore you in the person no one wants to talk to? Jesus, forgive me for the ways in which I judge and upset others with my words and actions. How often do I forget that you have carried so much for me? How often do I try to carry things on my own, not allowing you to help me? Jesus, help me not to forget the load that you carried for me. Give me the strength and the courage to let go of those things that push me away from you. How many times have I failed on my journey? So many times when I fall and fail, I don't feel like getting back up and trying again. Jesus, help me to remember your courage when you fell. Give me the strength to get back up when I fall. There are so many times when we forget that we are not alone in our struggles. Jesus, help me to remember that I am never alone in anything I face. How often do I not help someone in need? Do I let what others may think of me Stop me from reaching out. Jesus, help me follow Simon's example of helping others. How many times have I forgotten that you are in every person I meet, including me? Jesus, help me to recognise you in the people around me. Give me the courage to follow Veronica's example of treating others with love even when no one else does. How often do I forget what you did for me and how much love you have for each and every one of us? Jesus, help me to believe in your love for me. Do I listen to your words in my life? Do I try to do what you have asked us to do in the Gospels? Jesus, Help me to listen to your words of life and give me courage to keep trying to follow your example of love. How many times have we wanted to give up when we have really tried to do our best and have failed? Jesus, help me to follow your ways. Help me to remember that you are always there for me. Give me the strength to carry on trying my best even when I fail. How often have I stood by while others are sad or being picked on? Jesus, help me to see the people who are in need. Help me not to judge, but instead to do the right thing for the others around me. How many times have the bad things I've done become a strike of the nail into your body? How often do I turn away from your love and mercy? Jesus, help me to remember that you were nailed to that cross to take away all of my sins. Help me to ask for your forgiveness. With such love, you beg your Father to forgive us. 
then the sound of distant thunder. In the final silence, your whispered words. To you, my God, my spirit, I commend. Jesus, help me never forget your love for me. Help me to know that you died for me. Fill me with comfort in knowing that I am never alone when times get hard. How many times have I lost hope in you? Jesus, help me to trust in you. Help me to place all of my hope in you and to know that you will never fail me. You are put in a tomb and laid to rest, your body in clean linens. The stone is rolled over the entrance and now it surely is the end. While those you have lived with believe all is over, you are conquering sin and death. Jesus, help me always remember that death is not the end. Give me the strength to love every person, not just in words, but also with my actions. For the world, for all of those going through hard times in the world right now, give them the strength to keep fighting today, Lord. Help them to know they face nothing alone, because you will always be there. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. For this community, we pray for all the staff and students in our primary schools in the Nottingham Diocese. Help them to find hope and happiness now and always. We keep them and their families in our prayers at this time. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. For the church, that the church will continue to grow and get stronger. We pray for all of those who keep our parish and school communities together in faith. Remind us that your ultimate sacrifice is why we continue to praise you. Lord, in your mercy, hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Today, find some time to just be still. As we remember everything that happened on Good Friday, maybe spend some time creating your own cross or finding a cross from around your home. And today we invite you to place those crosses into your windows as a sign that today we remember that Jesus died on the cross for me and for you.